You're watching the world's largest small business summit online. And I believe it was the OJs who said it best when they said, money, 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 money. Money! I didn't write it. Actually, the OJs wrote it, then we lifted it, put it in a script format. But what's more important to start up, uh, to a startup small business than dead presidents and keeping those dead presidents? That's street talk. We're talking about money. And while there's no such thing as a free lunch, our next guest has the next best thing, free software. Microsoft Senior Program Manager John Tunaby joins us now. John, how are you? Very good, thank you. Thanks for being here. We're talking about Office Accounting Express, free, and you get so much more than your money's worth, even if you had paid for it. What is it? Well, let me step back a bit. There's about 25 million small businesses in the U.S., and they actually make up about half of our GDP. Now, out of those 25 million, less than 5 million actually use accounting software. Wow. Most others, they use Excel, they use pen and paper, maybe they Post -it use notes. their, yeah, their uh, bookkeeper or an mm -hmm. accountant to do their accounting. So there's a big market for accounting software for small businesses. Mm -hmm. Now also, 675,000 small businesses start every year, and 80% 80 of, 80 of those fail. And the reason why they fail is maybe they don't have a business plan. Right. Um, maybe they, they're not organized. They can't handle their finances. Maybe they just run out of cash. That's a problem. Sure. Um, so therefore, we created software for them to better manage their finances, and that is Office Accounting Express. First. Clearly, there's a need for it. You've exactly. just established that. And one of the beauties of it, Office Accounting Express, is how simple it is to set up. You're actually going to show us a live demo and set up a small business from scratch right now. Exactly. So all it takes is basically when you open up Office Accounting Express, you get this uh, start screen. Kay. You say start your new company, put in your, your company name, my little business, or whatever it is. Um, you put in your street address, cities, all your contact sure. information. Click next, then you, you pick your um, business type. Do they have Small Business Summit host on there? Uh, no, but Probably they do not. have consulting with no employees. I have none. That works. <laughs> we'll start there. So you click next, and all, that's all you have to do. You click finish, and okay. then we'll create a database. It takes about two minutes, and now you're up and running. That's really as long as it took to set it up. Exactly. So a lot of folks who are already in motion with their small business probably already have financial documents, things like uh, spreadsheets on Excel already, maybe even years of Excel, and they're probably worried about, well, I don't want to get some new software because do they speak to each other? How am I going to transfer? I do not want to retype everything, that's for sure. But it communicates. You can transfer from Excel? Yes. So as I just mentioned, a lot of these businesses are not using accounting software. They're right. using Excel. So what if I, I have an existing business? I just downloaded this for free from Microsoft, and I want to import all my transactions, sure. for instance, all of my invoices. All I need to do is click here, Import Excel Data. Okay. You say I want to import transactions. You browse to the file. I put it on the desktop. My file is called Import Invoices. Click Open. You click Next. You say I want to do my invoices. And then you say Match Fields. And this is basically when we're asking you, um, we, we want to know your invoice number, your invoice date, which customer, gotcha. what you're selling, blah, 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 all the stuff that's normally on an invoice. Mm -hmm. All you need to say, these are the fields in Office Accounting Express, and these are the Excel columns. Now, I use the, the template that comes with the software, so everything's okay. already matched up. I click OK. I click Next. And basically, not what we do now, we do data validation. So we look at, at the Excel sheet you provided, and we see if, um, if all the customers already exist, if uh, we're using, we're actually selling stuff that's in the software and so on. Gotcha. And we validate um, if we can process this. And if not, there'll be a, a button here with a few errors. And then you can look at those errors and, and fix it in the Excel gotcha. sheet so you can import it. So this process, all I need to do is click import, and that's okay. it. What about exporting to Word? Um, exporting to Word. Let me just finish here. It says finish. I'm done with importing. So um, that's a great question. Um, so I was talking to my mechanic, and he has a small business. He has three employees plus mm -hmm. himself, and um, I convinced him to use Microsoft Office Accounting. And he said, 
the first question he asked, but how will my invoices look? The invoice of small business is kind of their face to the world. When you think about them, you look at their invoice and do they look professional right. or not? Yeah. So um, he wanted very professional looking invoices. He wanted them with his logo and mm -hmm. everything. So let me just show you, I'll create a, an invoice here, um, how easy it is to export to work. So I click uh, new invoice. I pick a customer, um, let's say Global Sporting Goods. Um, we're going to sell them some fantastic kites here. We're going to sell them 10. Um, I can go in, I can put in, an, change the price. I can even put a, a $10 discount or 10% discount, whatever I wanted to. I save the invoice. Um, and now I just click export to Word. Um, and it just takes two seconds or so. Kay. And off comes the invoice, very professional looking um, in Word. Wow. And we even have a feature, you can see there's a logo, here's all mm -hmm. the stuff in there. Um, and you can, of course, you you can edit everything yourself. see PayPal there. And we have PayPal. So, so you get paid right away like that. Yeah, so you can send it out via email and then your customers can click and pay with PayPal. Wow. Well, we're in our final minute here. You've shown us some amazing tools. <laughs> in like almost no time, you ran us through several business functions. What's one thing you would want people to walk away who maybe you're currently doing on a notepad as far as what's one reason they really ought to upgrade, they really ought to get with us? Well, it's a lot easier for them to use this than, um, than Excel because they can manage their finances. And, um, well, we have a couple of features. We can list things directly on eBay. We can take Outlook appointments, convert them into time slips, and we can invoice them in a few clicks. So if you're a service business, it's perfect for you. What you're saying is there are far too many reasons to list right here. And I know I mentioned that Office Accounting Express is free, but did I mention it doesn't cost anything? But when your business outgrows the free version, you can upgrade to Office Accounting Professional simply by purchasing a product key. No CD needed. Thanks so much for your time today. For more information on it, log on to sbsummit.com.